Hi, I'm Alex, and I wanted to show you the TIG Pro's certification test weld fixture. They're a purge block or qualification welding fixture. Here is the angle iron that will be used mostly for the fillet welds. Here is the fixture as it sits for like groove welds. It also mostly be used for TIG welding. You can slide in a couple plates here. I'm just wearing gloves. This is normal to keep the oil and moisture off your metal. As you can tell, it's pretty easy to set that up. You can just finger tighten these and get welding. Just like that. There's one port in the back for argon or helium. You have about, I think it's 11. So you've got easily 10 inches of welding area there. This is all designed so you should be able to never take the hardware out. Take a peek at the copper section. This is a smaller radius here. And if you turn around, there's a larger one. For slightly larger welds. Since gas is blowing through there, it's not O-ringed, but that can be done if a company required it. There's just a step to help create the seal. Then we'll go on to talk about the fillet. This is all stainless steel construction. There's a aluminum base which could also be done in steel if you required that. But I've spent the last few months just designing everything on the Haas CNC machine. So here for the fillet, you can loosen these plates. They can also be removed quickly here. It's all slotted and inmate hardware. So if you go to do a fillet, you just position it like that right over our groove down here. Finger tighten these, and you're good to go on there. You can see inside here, there's a small pocket or chamber. And so we've actually machined the angle iron to have a encapsulated space. And so you can blow your helium or argon through that for the back side of the fillet. So I mean you potentially have like four purges going on. You got your normal cup, your block, and then this angle iron. But you could also use that angle iron piece on a job away from the fixture if you needed to. And you could lay it on the table and blow argon on the back side somewhere if you needed it. So you could use it as a tool also, which is kind of nice. And all these parts, you can order them and replace them if you end up getting splattered or damaging them. Or... And then here's our trailing cup. This is a CK cup. It's designed to be real tight against the cup so there's no void. And there's a diffuser and the metal screen in there. And that's your trailing cup for titanium and other reactive metals that are pretty hard to maintain nice and shiny and clean. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. That's just a quick glance at the fixture here. Um, I have one other piece I wanted to show you. So here is the angle iron chamber that's machined in the angle iron there. So that's just a real slick feature that I design to make things easier to work with and just beautiful. I mean, if you buy a tool, you want to get a nice tool. So thanks again. Good luck out there, guys. Keep on making that money and doing top-notch work.